Hey everyone, as and welcome back to my channel if you're new here, a really big welcome. Today I'm going to be showing you guys a haul from I Saw It First, as the title suggests. And I've actually never tried this brand before, um, but they had a really, really good Black Friday sale on. And would you believe I've been so busy that I've not had any time to even open these. So I thought, why not just open them on camera? The reason why I went with these guys was because I was looking for some um, winter knitwear and I had, do have like a decent amount I would say like this jumper is at least four years old and I do like try and look after my knitwear quite well so I saw it first had a 75% off sale I think I'm pretty sure it's 60 or 75% off and I thought what better way to try the clothing and then also to like update my winter wardrobe. So my first order, I actually made two orders. The first day of Black Friday um, or Black Friday weekend, my order was £106, so not cheap, but I saved £156, so it was a really, like really, really good deal. I'm hoping that the quality of these clothing items are really great. And then this little bag here, my second order, um, this was a, a smaller one. It was £32 and I ended up saving £45 um, on their sale. Now obviously this is one of those sites that their sales are so massive that you kind of think either your prices are completely marked up, which a lot of brands do to be fair. I'm sure a lot of brands obviously the cost price is a lot lower than, than the price that we're buying it for. But you know when they have such big price like jumps in the sale, it is a little bit like well how much is your product actually worth? And why should I buy from you guys day to day? Like when I know that you're gonna have a really good sale for Black Friday slash Boxing Day. I don't know if any of you guys know what I mean, but that's kind of how I feel. That's why like me and my sister laws were all saying that we're just gonna wait till this time of year now to buy most of our stuff, especially skincare, makeup and stuff. There's no point buying it full price. I've kind of always lived by that philosophy, but there's no point living, buying it full price when you know that it's gonna be 20% off, 25% off at some point in the year. So you might as well like wait and save um, or be smart. And like, if you know you're gonna wear a foundation, like if you go for two bottles of a specific one in the year, buy two in the sale <laughs> and then you're saving money. But anyway, so the first thing that I can see here is the balloon sleeve knitted cardigan and this is supposed to be in the shade brown it says brown on the label but it's definitely beige which i'm glad about because i wanted the beige so this purchase was completely inspired by my lovely friend masuma she had this gorgeous balloon sleeve uh, maxi cardigan on uh, when we went for sushi i don't know if you guys remember in the vlog and she just looks so cute in it so i don't think she got it from here but I am loving the detailing of that balloon sleeve. How cute is that? And I'm very happy with the shade because sometimes the shades can be really off. So far, obviously this is only the first item, so let me just tom horses. But so far, I'm really happy with the color. The quality seems nice. Um, I can't like sort of see any threads hanging out and it looks like a nice quality and it looks nice and thick and warm as well. So this full price is £40. I am gonna be doing a try on as well. I'll probably do a reel on my Instagram again because you guys love that. My Zara reel did so well, which I was really surprised about. So the try on clips here will also be in a reel form as well. So first item, Thumbs up, let's see the second one. So next up we have the dark gray wide sleeve knitted maxi cardigan. This is as well 40 pounds and this is a maxi length. So super, super modest. I'm very excited for this. And yeah, do you know what? I really like the design of the sleeves. They're three quarter length and they're quite different. I don't have anything in my wardrobe like this. They're just a different sort of look. They're kind of quite boxy. And I'll be interested to see how maxi this is on me so far it's definitely going past the news which is great because it just it's going to add extra warmth and extra coverage and that's always a good thing from modest wardrobe hijabi wardrobe so yeah so far liking the look of that this one or the other one actually doesn't have any buttons or any fastenings they're just an open style cardigan right sticking to the maxi cardigan theme i've got a black knitted cardigan and this is just like a regular cardigan design there's no balloon sleeving going on here and there's no oh actually there is i didn't realize that it doesn't say balloon sleeve but actually it's it is a bit of a balloon sleeve yeah it's tight um sort of on this part here but yeah that's quite cute and it's a maxi design. I just thought the black color would be super versatile. Oh, and we've got pockets here, which is great. I love a cardigan with pockets. 
Um, and yeah, just it would be really, really versatile. I might wear this to work, I'm not sure, but I definitely, you know, will be wearing this like when going out and about. Sometimes you don't want to wear a super thick coat and you just want a nice warm piece. And the quality so far does seem really decent. So, uh, so far, every single item that I've shown you is £40 for price and the quality is nice. So, you have to see how they wash. Um, but yeah, they do look really nice and good quality. So fingers crossed. All right, number four. I got a stone basic sweatshirt. This is £15 full price. And I got this in the colour beige in the size medium. And do you know what? It's not quite the same colour as the picture. So if I show you guys the picture of the girl wearing it, it's much more of a white stone colour. This has come out as much more of a peachy colour. So, mm, not that happy with that I saw at first but this is just like a basic sweatshirt I thought these would be quite good for when I go on my runs because I want something that's long sleeve but not thick or heavy and this is a really nice texture for that actually because I got size medium like hopefully it's not going to be finger hugging it doesn't look like it will be so yeah the color is not what I had hoped this one is a bit disappointing but in terms of like will it serve its purpose for what I got it for, finger trust it will. I'll, I will keep you guys posted on my Instagram stories. And by the way, I got that in a size medium. I got the balloon sleeve beige cardigan in a size 12. I got the black cardigan in a size M and I got the grey cardigan in a size 10. It just depended on what sizes were available. I think they are all pretty oversized which is why I kind of went for my own size which is size 10 to 12 so I got another one of their basic sweatshirts these are 15 pounds full price and this is in the color khaki and I'm happy to say that this is the color that it's described and the same color as the one in the picture and this I got in a size L so it is definitely going to be on the oversized well definitely definitely on the oversized side of things but I'm not complaining, I think that makes it like even more modest. I mean, these aren't the longest, so I would wear looser, baggier joggers with these when I'm going for my little runs. But yeah, I just think that they're gonna be really, really good for exercising. These were really good deals, especially because they were like 65, 70% off. Another knitted piece here. Oh, I'm so excited for this one. So this is the Stone Knit Belt Dress in the color beige i got this in the size medium and this is 35 pounds full price so i'm excited to see how this looks on it's pretty much the same color as that stone cardigan it feels nice and soft we've got long sleeves here that are slightly wide it just looked really classy on the model and it's got a belt as well so I'm excited to wear this. I'm not 100% sure how I would style this in terms of bottoms. I think probably with like wide leg trousers or maybe straight leg trousers. But yeah, this looks really, really nice. And I can't wait to wear this and try it on and see what I think. The final thing in this package is quite a big item here. Um, this is a black oversized ruched sleeve bomber jacket. Oh my goodness, this was expensive. Full price, this is £75. What? I don't remember. Oh my gosh. I hope this is really nice because that means that I paid at least sort of £40 for this. So, oh, this might be going back if I don't love it, guys, because that's expensive for a jacket. And also if it doesn't fit well. So, this is what it looks like. Kind of hard to show you guys. Right, let me have a quick look at this. So on the model, she's wearing it with a black hoodie. It looks very effortless. And that's, I think, what I liked about it. But I don't know if I love it, to be honest. It's super, super light. Like, it's not really gonna add much warmth at all. This is definitely more of an aesthetically pleasing piece. The sleeves are cool. I definitely like the sleeves. I'm gonna try this on and see what I think. I like the fact that it's got pockets. It's got silver hardware which is not my fave but i don't mind it sometimes this is the first thing that i'm like oh that's a maybe i'll leave it on screen um obviously i've got my returns thing here that is a maybe the rest of the stuff i'm pretty certain i'm going to be keeping unless i look horrendous in them but i just feel like they're going to be really really good staple pieces for this winter and you know winters after that then my second order came in this very jazzy snazzy bag over here so 
just gonna get my scissors and cut along the line in case I need to return stuff. But yeah, I was so excited about my first order that I had to go back on the website and then have a look again. Boxing Day sales, I have kept away from clothing sites. I've only purchased two foundations because Debenhams are closing down and they had really like decent prices. Like I've never seen NARS on 25% off before. 20% yeah, 25% no. I'm trying not to buy any more clothes because I did buy quite a lot in the Black Friday sales. So anyway, the second order, the first thing I got, which is a bit risky, look at this color, oh my goodness, I don't have many color knits at all, and if they are, they're usually khaki green, because that's my fave, but I got the Sage Turn Up Cuff Jumper, and this was originally £35, and I got this in a size a small to medium. Do you know what? I actually really like this. I really like this colour. I feel like even though it's colour, it's quite a wearable kind of colour, do you know what I mean? It's not too bright, it's not neon-y and yeah, I quite like this. I think it'll look really, really nice with jeans and I love the sleeve detailing. You've got turn up sleeves like so and it's not too thick, which is quite nice. So in terms of length, because it is quite short, I mean the model is wearing it tucked in, but I feel like you could definitely wear like a longer top underneath if you wanted more coverage um if you're wearing it with slightly more fitted jeans or you could wear it with a skirt but i think that's really cute and i really like this color so that's definitely getting a thumbs up and then my final item in this whole haul is the khaki balloon sleeve knitted cardigan guys there's just something about balloon sleeves that looks so so cute and i hope it's not just because like my friend Masuma is really tiny and adorable and petite I hope I don't look weird in them because I don't have that same <laughs> that same figure and height. This is just a regular size cardigan. The nice thing is that cardigans do go past your butt, so you do have that coverage. I like the colour. So if you compare the two khakis here, this is more of a warm brown, like so I would say it's more of a traditional khaki, and this is more to me of an army green. Yes, I'm gonna be a bit fussy because I love my greens, but this is what the cardigan looks like. So this is in a size 10 by the way, I like it so far, I like it, it's got a tighter knit, the sleeve joining does look a bit odd, I don't know if you guys can see, can you see? Because the type of knit, and I, this is going to expose how little I know about clothing, but like the type of knit here is like a thicker design, and then this one is much more tighter and smaller, but it's different, it's different you know, but I'm going to try that on again and see how I feel. Obviously, these are all just such a bargain. So that originally would have been, for those two items, £75, but I only paid £30. So they were basically £15 each. And I think for £15, a decent quality cardigan or jumper is a real bargain in my eyes. And I just feel like, yeah, knitwear, I've said it before, but it's just one of those things that you just bring out every winter. I just have like one bag of like winter clothing. My knitted skirt cohort that I got when I got married. This jumper was in there as well. There's a few other bits and it just made me so happy. I was like, yes, cozy clothing. Um, Cause even, even now you guys with the heating on and everything, some of these rooms, I don't know what it is. There's a bit of a draft and sometimes they can still feel really cold. So it's just nice to be like cozying up in warm clothes that are not your dressing gown 24 seven. Cause I know we're home like a lot of the time. I know that we're home and we're stuck at home, but that doesn't mean you have to wear your pajamas all the time. Like I'm not saying you shouldn't. I love wearing pajamas, but I feel like sometimes when you actually get dressed and you're wearing cozy, nice clothes that are comfortable, but like look, make you feel good. You feel more productive. You feel more ready to face the day. That's how I feel anyway. So yes, yeah, so that was my haul. I'm so excited to try these things on and I hope the trials came out okay. And yeah, um, let me know what your favorite piece was down below and I will see you in the next video. Take care guys, bye.